Hey everyone, this is Misty from Mac Jewelry. Here to show you how to make some simple earrings for Christmas as a gift or for yourself. The first pair I'm going to teach you how to make is these cute little Christmas trees. And it's got a jingle bell hanging on the top of it. I thought it was really different. Really cute. So, I'm going to show you them first. What you're going to need is a big cap, 3 millimeter rounds, I'm using silver, a spacer, a daisy spacer, excuse me, whatever you got, um, two different sizes of rondelles, I'm using a 4 and I think that's a 6 or an 8, and you're going to need a bell. You're going to need a head pin and an eye pin, but, but I don't know where my eye pins are, so I'll show you how to use a head pin to do the other part. Alright, so this is what you need to do. Pick up your 4mm, or 3mm, sorry. And you're going to put that underneath your spacer. No. Use that underneath your bead cap. So your bead cap stays on. You got another spe another 3 millimeter. You're going to pick up your large rondelle. I'm going to say large because I'm not sure what size it is. And... the other rondelle you have pick up your sp your spacer uh oh forgot a bead you need a four millimeter in any color for the tip for like the tree topper add your four millimeter or lock or lock at that And that's what it should look like. Then you're going to take your cutters, you're going to cut the tip, cut some of your wire off, and you're going to turn and turn and turn to where it's rolled up, <clears throat> kind of like a split ring show let me see we'll do it this way hmm it's not gonna do it well you're gonna roll it up like it's a split ring and I'm just gonna squeeze it to make sure that you ain't got no pokey thing all right, you can take your head pin if you ain't got an eye pin. Let me turn my light back on, guys. You can take your head pin. You can cut the tip of it off, and you're gonna make a loop. Like that. Hmm. Like that. And what you're going to do is you're going to open the loop, slip your jingle bell on there, close your loop, maybe, there you go, uh, it's not going to show, anyway, then you're going to take, cut some of your wire off, you're going to make your loop, well, cut just a little bit. You don't need a whole lot of wire. Just enough to make a little bit of a loop. Like that. And 
and then you're gonna open it open the loop slip your tree you just made on it maybe maybe not open the loop up a little bit more all right that should work close your loop all right <clears throat> you're gonna need an ear finding and you're gonna twist it open Slip your earring on there. Close it up. And there is your cute little Christmas trees with a jingle bell hanging on it. Is that gonna focus? There we go. It's a little different, but I think they're cute. And I mean, you can make them with squares or different size rondelles if you want, but you know, that's just another way of doing it. <clears throat> the other one I'm going to show you how to make is this little light bulb. And them are very cute. What you're going to need, <coughs> you're going to need a 10 millimeter bicone. Sorry. There we go. 10 millimeter bicone. You're going to need a rondelle. And you're going to need a 3 millimeter round bead. And of course, a head pan and an earring finding. Take your, nope, take your bicone, rondelle, and your three millimeter, and you're going to put it on like that. You're going to clip some wire off, and you're going to make your, your loop, and again, just keep rolling. You don't have to do it like this. I do. You know, I just started doing it. I, I make loops other ways too, but I like doing it this way. Take your ear finding. Open it up by twisting it. Slip your earring on. And close it. And there you go. Excuse me. Two simple, cute little earrings for Christmas. Alright guys, if you like this video, hey, hit me up, let me know. Subscribe, leave a comment, click that like button. And uh, thank you for joining me. Y'all have a good night. Bye.